Okay. Right. I think more than an hour and a half. Oh, that's right. Uh, so, oh, right on. Yeah, that's on the side. I can't write. Somebody it. took a look to the guy. Um, I'm not allowed to see it. Yeah, I totally could do any mistake. I didn't make a mistake. It didn't have a one on there. That's all. Yeah. It's going to be on YouTube later. Yeah, the YouTube. Uh, doing all this. Okay, but we didn't explain the concept because we have to put it, you know, we have to push the pitch in place and we can, we can uh, at that time we have to do it quick and we don't have time to explain things like the basic of this is that uh, we now we have another feature, another subset and uh, we're going to work with a with our system, with our admin system, we call it FRS. And with this uh, tool, we can manage the files. And no matter where, where, where it belongs, uh, no matter if it's from the scan or it's in common facts or something, uh, we can manage this and we can put the uh, reference things and description. We can combine it. Uh, we can create new files. We can, uh, we can use uh, documents and upload it from the system, and then we can manage it. Okay. So the, the basic thing is that right now we must uh, begin using the system. Uh, we have to try to eliminate the fax machine. I knew I saw that sometimes uh, you try to send uh, incoming fax. I mean. You send faxes to embolgon on again to get the document and make a relation between the, the app and the document. So Jester, for example, uh, you someone uh, sent two faxes. But I'm not trying to say they hate you or not yet, but that's good. But Jester, for example, we have a three lines for clients, and two of them were sent common faxes from Ebold zone. So we were, we were trying to charge to load two files from the fax machine and one client tried to send a fax and we didn't have any line available. So <coughs> was it bank packages that were getting sent? I don't know what yeah. it was. Yeah. 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 There's no is there another way to send them? Yeah. And I'll have to talk to the master. No, what we were doing is we're doing the bank packages uh -huh. to the system before they went to the bank. And so those we would have to oh, No, that's them. fine, that's fine. We'll that's have to continue doing that unless we're gonna be Okay, but it's, it's a kind of but you process. try to put it in the system to make relation between between that package and the app, Correct. right? And that's what you send it by the fax machine. Mm -hmm. Right now, it's easier to feed the fax than it is to be okay. scanned. Okay, it's the same when we make a scan, right? Uh, yeah, but it's easier on the fax because you're feeding page, you know, pages. <laughs> yeah, but in the fax, in the scan, you can put the the loss of the pages, mm -hmm. and you can scan it there. The so yeah. it's the same thing because you're using the fax machine it's just like, that like don't a have, scanner. Yeah, it's just that sometimes the contract. Or you know, the long the legal, the okay. UTC. So those will go through the fax, the scanner. Okay, that's, that's we'll fine. But we we will try to use more the scanner to to okay. leave the lines available for the client. Okay. 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 Uh, you see this? Okay, this is the admin. So here we can manage PDF, Word, Excel, images, fax files, and text files in the system. So we can combine this. We can create a new file with all this uh, kind of uh, format. Okay? Um, the FRS control all the going and incoming faxes. All the stuff that is been before that you assign to to uh, rev ID and you assign app ID, uh, app ID, et cetera. It's the same thing that's going to happen in outbound faxes. Okay. I'll bond faxes and, and, and uploads. <laughs> when the concept is that fax, incoming fax is a file. That's why maybe you saw in this, that's the point here. Maybe you saw that always that you have an incoming fax here, you have a here. The same, the same file, right? You see, always you have this one, you have it here. So 
this because we have income. We, we manage a, a concept here that we have income effects, but we manage a concept into here that affects income effects in the file. So what I, I'm talking about that because we go if we're going to manage and we're going to handle outgoing effects, we have to be clear in our mind that um, that uh, that is a file and I can't combine it. I can't this. I can send it by fax. It's the same fax, right? It's just a file. So this document, I can send it by fax. In this case, we have a new feature here that if I do it here, if I put it there, send by fax, so I'll have the same thing. I got a page, I got all the options, I have the relation between my file and my app ID, okay? And I can fill out all the all the the information to send the fax. All it's gonna appear here, if you don't have uh, the co applicant or the or the seller information, on always gonna appear there's something. I mean the applicant, the uh, it's going to be the first of the line that you have to be careful with that because you cannot send a fax to a wrong person. That's a confidential information. So you have to be, all the time, you have to uh, care about who are you talking, sending to and which is the fax number. This fax number here always updates. I mean, if you use, if I put an extra more in here and I change my phone and put A, for example, and I send this, it's going to update my information in the database. So always going to get the last, the last that number that I use. So because people change factors, so we're not going to use the class to, to the to the uh, contact information and change it and then come back again. No, we just put it the last that I sent. You just have to be careful with that, the actual number. Exactly, always. Could you Maybe in the beginning it's going to be like that. The next is going to be automatically so. If you know the a person that you always send a fax, you know, you always say, well, this phone is good for me. Uh, it's, it's right. Could you also go over the nine, the one? Okay, area? the nine. You don't have to put the nine. This is a fax machine. Okay, here you have to put the right uh, the number that it comes. No matter you have to see what it has a one or it has a eight or it has a zero. No matter that. And all of them have to have the one. In the area. Yeah, yeah. Well, if it's out of our area. If it's out of our area. Yeah, if we're talking about a dialist, it's what I would see. Some numbers come with one no matter where are you. So okay. you have to put the one if the number comes with the one. Okay? That's very important. So the system, we send the facts, and the system always going to check. Every 10 minutes, it's going to check if the facts is. is if the fax uh, already is sent or if the fax is always still there. So when the fax is still there, it's because it's the wrong number, it's, it's not, uh, the line's not available, the fax is not available. So that's, that's going to be during 30 minutes. In 30 minutes, you couldn't send a fax that's going to give you a fail like this. Okay? okay? You say fail and you go to the fax. Well, I have a lot of fails. <laughs> I have to delete all of this stuff. Okay, you go here again, and what happened here? You got the option to send it again because you don't have to, to type again all the information, the numbers. Okay, so you say resend. When you say resend here, okay, if you don't send it, fail is going to disappear. No matter if you send it or not, if you say resend, Fail is going to disappear because I don't want to have a fail option there all the time. You know? That's why. So the fail option works to remind the people that you have a fail fax there and you have to resend it. If you come here and you don't resend it because you just have to change the status and you do it by email or something, you have to put resend and then it's going to, the fail is going to disappear. No matter if you put here send or not. You get that? That's very important because then you're going to call them and say, Yes, or no, so I cannot, I'm built from there and I cannot put it out. Oh, okay. 
So the, the way is that one, that you could re-sender, so that's going to appear again, the, all the information. It's up to you if you want to send it or not, but the tail message is going to disappear. Okay? Got it, Kim? Got it. Not complicated, it's very easy. You got it it your mind is on the side of the side of your yeah, mind. Once we try it on there, so we may see a lot of fails, but it's not on purpose. Okay. <laughs> Here we got new features in our list and our uh, navigation uh, menu. So we got here uh, send faxes, fax list, we know the fax list, outgoing faxes, and file list. We always make difference between, between file list and, and fax list. Why? Because when, I'm, when I want to, for example, go to file. Okay. What happens if I have a document in my computer and I have to load it? What happens in Word or what happens in PDF or something? I want to load it. That is a file. I don't know if it's going to be a fact. I don't know that. I just want to make a, a relation between the app and, and the file and the document. When I say a fa file, you have to imagine that it's a document. Okay? So, how I can make a relation between them? Because this is not some, not, I, I doesn't have any relation between facts right now. It's just a document that I want to make a relation between that, between that and the app ID. May I say something? Uh -huh. I've actually been actively working with this. This comes in handy when you're receiving an email. You receive something that you want to attach to the file, but it, it's separate. Like I'll get something in an email, I'll save it to my desktop, and I'll go and browse looking for the file to attach to the application. Exactly. Awesome. This is something you're going to work with. This is something you will use every day. So we can go into our email and, and put it in the file you now. It's you not an email, but if there's a document in your email. Right. That's what I have. Mm -hmm. So you can load it in the system. When you load it in the system, you now, at that time, you have a description, you have the file, so you can handle the file. What I mean to handle the file, I can send it by fax. In the future, we're going to have an email feature here. So we're going to handle it by email, too. So that's why we call it FRS, you know, to call it fax system. Somebody sends you a survey um, by email. You want the survey to be attached to the application. That's what you're going to use. Okay. It's very easy. I have something like that. I have a, a picture. Now the pictures, actually, he may have to help on those out for some reason, but the documents. Yeah, I know in the beginning there's going to be some confused, okay? And you can call me and I'll explain you 20 times more. Oh, yeah. Okay. You probably <laughs> I was as a fact, log itself that confused at first, and now it's like nothing. <laughs> you know, at first, yeah. you're like, huh? <laughs> to upload a file, you just have to be a new file and go to the browse and and select from uh, let's select this one. So put here uh, and you just upload it. Okay, now I have it here. At this time, I have the file. This file, I have it in the system, so I can see it if I want. Okay, or I can make relation between this file and the uh, app. Okay, it's the same thing that works with incoming facts. And with incoming facts, we have the options to put the app ID over there. It's the same thing. So what happens if I put it there? So here. It's going to appear. Let's do it. Remember, save it. Okay. If I go to the file, <coughs> here is the file, right? Can you see it from there, Maria? Mm -hmm. So it's the same thing. Okay. Okay. So, I think it's part.
So we have another tool, very powerful, that we're going to use a lot. That's the, the uh, tool that helps us to combine the files. Okay? This uh, option you can choose. Uh, and I'll go in fact from the menu. Ten facts, sorry. Okay. So here you can construct a file with a lot of kind of things. In this case I can put here if I put the, if I change here the app ID, all the files that have relation between this app ID is gonna appear when I try to add a file, for example. Okay. If I put an app ID over here, <laughs> all the files that have relation with that is gonna be okay. So I I can choose it there. I can make a preview. <laughs> That's happening. I think it was. That's more physical. Okay. So I can make a preview here. And then uh, if I'm sure that that's the document that I want to send, so I, I just fill out all the files. Go to Master Morin. Test. Test. I put Nestor more because you know we cannot send this back to no. to no somewhat right. So here you have another option that's create a uh, file, a PDF file, but it's just a note. When you have to write a note, just make a little uh, sentence with telling something particular. So we you can you can make a file PDF file uh, on the fly. Okay. Okay, well you can be watching me like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to learn. Okay. It's the light, those lights are great, it's not you. <laughs> okay, that's good. Keep them in like your face. <laughs> 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 There's no one on here, Nestor. <laughs> <laughs> I heard you talking, it's about me. <laughs> okay. Nothing personal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nothing personal. Kim, I don't like your face. <laughs> what? Please smack him? No. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, hello world. Hello world. Hello world. No, I'm making my face. So there is hello world file there. So this just uh, create a PDF file and mm -hmm. the next clear one. I put some notes or something particular. You want to put a uh, description and some, uh, I mean, I don't know, part one. If you write it, part two, and you write it, part three, something very specific so you can create it there. So what happens if we supposed to preview again? So we have the first file, right? And actually, well, Nestor, that's a yes, bank package. package. That's a bank package. So that's something that we're going to have to uh, maybe go with Raquel and just our next one for today, maybe next step, to scan it. Okay. Okay, because these are going to be consistent throughout every day, uh, multiple. Okay, I know. Okay. But well, you say they have to have a letter have have some letter legal some uh, mix. But you can reduce it on the scan, right? No, I'll just, you can reduce but the I'm document. I'm talking more yeah. feeding. Yeah, I'm talking more of the feeding. Yeah, if you get halfway through that, that jam. You know what I mean? So I'm yeah. talking about well, it. there's. I think that maybe in the future you will have cases that you cannot. So you have a big page, so you have kind of, I mean, you have 75 facts or something. 
by which we will try to figure it out. Okay. Once we do um, have the packets, have the copies set first, have and, and scan yeah. the copies in the copies. Okay, so we'll work with some color on that. Okay, this is the last page, so, I mean, the last page of, of the same document, and then we come here and see the little work. <laughs> so, we have the combined uh, files. We have the package that we receive by fax, and we have a new document that we create on the fly. Say hello, world. Mm -hmm. That is a tough sheet. That's very, 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 very important. I'm going to tell you now. You're scary. <laughs> <laughs> you're a scary. <laughs> yeah. Don't be a company. You're a scary. 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 You can go to Rome. I think everyone has that for closing. Well, for the people that have that page, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You can add it, all the documents here, you can choose the documents. Uh -huh. You can add it. Uh -huh. So, always, I recommend this thing to uh, have before you send the fax, make a preview. Okay? Maybe it will relate something it depends on the, how many pages and things, right? You have to be patient sometimes if you have 60 pages or something like that, 70 pages, so it's going to be like the uh, Like Seller Doc should be able to, to do that. Right. And the is for Okay. Mm -hmm. So right now, if you go down, see, now you have, you have here, all the all the PDF selectors. Remember the page PDF selectors? No, we have it here. This is very bored or something. No, no it's just me. Do say estimate. So there's options. You have you can choose something. If you don't have any FID over here, so it's an open file. Open file. It's an open. You won't have. Uh, logos or nothing. We will. You just have. We have the uh, documents that we attach there, mm -hmm. and then when you send it, you won't have logos. You don't have anything. Just a plain thing. Okay. You get that. So if it's not attached to, if it's not attached, it recognizes as RB. This is uh, the boat. It's a boat or it's an aircraft. So the pen of that is going to put a, a cover base with the with the exactly. Color page, okay. So you don't have to pick it out the color page. You don't have to fill. You don't have to fill the, the files here, and the cover page is going to create it out of them. Everything that you show. Yeah. I'm showing an example. Yeah. I'm showing. Do you want to teach us something? Time to go around. Oh, 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 okay. 
I'm trying to do my best, you know, and I got to get out of that language for anything, too. Okay. So. Yeah, that's a cat anymore. We already know you guys. Okay. You know what? <laughs> you know what? 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 Okay. Like this. Okay. Is this for... I, I had a question for you, man. Do the facts you send from the machine get saved also, or just the ones you send through this thing get saved? Mm -hmm. Is do you save outgoing faxes into like a PDF file? Or yeah. Do you yeah. Only the ones that you send through your system get saved, or the ones even if I go to the machine and put it through the machine with that. Get okay, saved? we have two two kinds of files. We have the the source file. If the old file created, I mean the. Uh, that combined file that we that, that we made here is going to the PDF. It is not with cover letters, not with the, just the file. Because we can send it again to another person. We can send it to you know, and we cannot put a cover letter there. Okay, I think what Casey was saying is he back through the fax machine like some goofy stuff, and he wanted to make sure that you guys didn't like save it. Yeah, I'll say if I type out like a pull request sheet to one person and then I can kind of save it because so that emails them out. So that actually take me time to send that in fact that's then same in the email. So if I fax something out of that machine over there, it'll get converted into a PDF that I can access? Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, of course. Well, I'm just saying, Casey. Okay. The, the little one. That's the one I always use. That's that. <laughs> 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 yeah, but the, the thing that I'm trying to say is something maybe it's going to help for you saying you're going to have two files the source, source file, and the stamp file. Okay. The source file is the original. You have corporation anything. You can save it in the computer, you can see it everywhere, whatever you want. So the sense file has the cover letter. Okay. So if you want to retain the sense file, you can retain it. You have the cover letter. So the next time you're gonna have two cover letters. And how do you access it? Is it you have like a PDF? Yeah, so over. you can access to all the files. Like this. If you click here, you come here and you save it. Okay. I got you. Okay. Can you see the facts over there? Yeah. That's what to do with the system. That's what's my question. It's totally separate. And okay. the facts that I will not be allowed. That's what I was asking. Okay. Cool. That's where there's phone cabin in the church. Playing 20,000 words. <laughs> okay. Uh, we're waiting for the soundtrack. <coughs> Well, this won't slow our systems down, will it? Huh? All the, the fasting systems, is, will we see a, a slowdown mm. in our computers? Well, this is all going to be part of the computer, so this, are we going to see any kind of a slowdown? Say we have a really super long fax going to go through. Are we going to experience any slowdown in our working systems? No. Like it's no. a lot of programs no. running at once. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's a no. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Uh, <laughs> Just watch what you're sending. <laughs> okay. okay. So here we have the source. We create a source file. So we have here, it's no cover letter or nothing, because I can send it again, and I don't want the cover letter there, because maybe I want to send it to other people, or other person. So in that case, I don't need it. But, let's see, come on, transmitting, okay, maybe it's ready. Can you tell you what page is on? Okay. Here is the status bar. The status bar always going to tell you what is happening with the fax. So right now, I know that I didn't send the fax because I have a pending fax there. 
if I want to go to the next to out, outgoing fast split, I just click here and I go to the outgoing. So here, you saw you saw these options before, right? Because I put it something like a tool three months ago. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're gonna use it. We got incoming effects and outgoing effects. So here, I can see any details of my factors and what's going on with that. And what I see, I do it, whatever. I, I can change the description. I can change everything. But it's just a file, OK? No matter if I send it by fax or, fax or not, it's just a file. Okay. Sorry, I'm trying to wait for this. Mm -hmm. Can you send more than one fax at once? Huh? Can you send more than one fax at once? Exactly. No, I send a one file combined. Okay? I combine it, a lot of stuff from for a lot of sources and put it there and I create a new file and then I send it. Okay. Another question? Very good. Wait, okay. <laughs> here uh, we have another option. When we put here facts, I'm going to use screen directly. Okay. You see a new option here? Facts. You go into this page. This is going to be your best, your best friend. Okay. Best friend. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good faith estimates. So we have we had a new option given then I got by fact. So you put it there automatically. So I can see if I can see a preview. <laughs> and fill out all the information. Okay, so more <laughs> So if you see right now files, strange files and things in the application, you know we all have to run from the seven. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think that you saw it already. Okay. So when you send it, it creates a PDF file. Every time that I send a fax, it creates a, a new PDF. So if it's an original document, if the document does not exist, it's going to create it. Uh, let's say estimate, it's a virtual document. I just use it for print it and then disappear. So in this case, if I send it by fax, it's going to create it like a PDF. So I have, I'm going to have the original. I'm going to have the send. Okay, I'm gonna have to when I send it and what happened with that if a client calls and say, No, oh, you didn't send me anything because you should have to go there. You wanted to send it by email or something, okay. So you have to save the original. Not this one, the tenth one. Okay, so you're gonna have anything that we know which one is what? Yes, I have. Okay, look. Are you gonna have like some things that we know which one because we'll be sending a lot of them, right? Yeah. Which one do we know? Okay, in this in this case, you choose the original, okay. the source, and then it's going to display for all all the faxes that you send it from from this one, and it's going to tell you sent. Okay. okay. Now we're going to see the difference between when we have the original, the source, and, we, and when we send it already. Here, we have the create file, the original. So I create it with a combined with my tool there and put things, put things in the list and I create it. In this case, I have a sent file here. So if I put a view, I'm going to create the sent file. Okay. It's the same history. You can click here, save it. And send it by email. He said, "No, you didn't send me anything." So I have to, I have to do it here. Even he has the time and everything when the fax came. came. Okay. 
So can you see the difference between them? The source and the test. So we're going to have that. If I want to uh, see all the faxes that I can, I just do all going faxes and one of them separated. No matter if it comes from one file, going always to display uh, the fax that I sent. Okay? Did I complicate your life or something? Or this is all for you, right? Because we can train in two days with this. Yeah. No, we can practice it. For sure. Okay, to finish this. Green, 10 facts, fax list, outgoing. Faxes and file list. This Is this clear? When I when I want what happens if I want to uh, load the file where I'm going here? What I have to choose here if I want to load? File. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. What happens? File. File. Okay, I have to go file it. Oh, sorry. File. It. I have to go to file it and say. Add a new file, okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now, we have another stuff. Can we go to the scanner and see what happens if I try to scan? <laughs> what happens here? Okay, it's like a, what he's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. 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 I can do the documents here. I can do this there. What happened if you click that? Do you know how to scan? Okay, let me just show the scan. Go ahead and finish here, and then go on to the. Come on, Rafael. Come on, Sigita. Andale! Andale, andale. Okay, old you. I see that you use this machine. Somebody going to use this machine. What do you ask? Oh, I'm going to use it to scan. Thank you. You're still scanning with your name or just the regular scan? And you go to the culture server. Call them again. So at this time, we're going to begin to use our profile. Okay, we're going to press the scanner and then scan button lower. Scanner here. Scanner here. Is this machine for me? Okay. Scanner here. And I'm going to try to um, uh, locate my profile inside the, the scanner. So we got loads, goes, to <laughs> okay, so you choose your name here. All of your names are over here in the system. Okay, because this is important for you. <laughs> okay, so you choose here. Okay. You put your name here. They start. Like I scan, but I'm not going to scan a regular. Uh, I mean, you always put something there and go to the uh, to the server and get your your file right. Mm -hmm. At this time, it's already programmed to uh, make relation between this and the system. So if I if I scan this, it's going to get my profile and going to send the fax, and this fax is going to appear in my list in my file list. It's happening to you. Yeah. So it says um, press the star or press to finish. So and you'll have to do that to say you just follow the prompt, stop it because it continues to hit start. That'll just give you blanks. Yeah. My PDF pages. So you have to to be to finish the document when you already scanned. So you have to press no more. Yes, it's, 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 it's,
Um, Mr. Kell, is she on there? Uh, I have to see. She will have to be added. Okay. No problem. Oh, you will be. You have to make Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have to get back. Yeah. yeah. In all the process, it, you have to wait for I think one or two minutes. Something like that. A few minutes Pretty because quick, right? yeah. they actually have to be quick. Has to do the conversion to whatever it's yeah. you know going to do. <laughs> okay, and then yes, right. Come back. Yeah, we're pretty Thank you. 